Hi, this is Nathaniel in the Holy Land. Behind me uh, is uh, Jerusalem, the Eternal City. If you've never had the chance to see this, we're going to show you some clips. But more so, we invite you to join us in the Holy Land. We do use, uh, we do make a number of trips here, and you're welcome to join us. Come and experience the most amazing trip that you can have in your lifetime. Every Christian to, should come to the Holy Land at least once and walk on the steps of Jesus and just see this beautiful uh, eternal city, Jerusalem, and all the places in the Holy Land. The most sacred site in Israel is the Wailing Wall, the Western Wall, uh, that is remaining as part of the Temple Mount. It's not part of the Temple, there's nothing of the Temple left, but it's part of the Temple Mount. That is behind me and we're going to walk next to it. And if you come to Israel, you'll have the opportunity to actually pray at the Wailing Wall. We are in the Garden of Gethsemane, where Jesus prayed with his disciples. His disciples fell asleep. Some of the olive trees that are here are still around from 2,000 years ago. An authentic place where Jesus spent his time in prayer before the crucifixion. Well, friends, we are now at the Garden Tomb in Jerusalem, uh, where Jesus was buried. And the tomb is currently empty. 
It was only boiled for a few days, three days, and it's empty, and it's been empty since because Jesus Christ has risen. If you come to Israel, you have to visit the garden too, and see it for yourself that the tomb is empty, Christ is alive. Well, friends, this is Masada, the place of patriotism here in Israel. Uh, this year, Israel celebrates 70 years of independence. We pray for Israel from up here from Masada, and we join in celebration for this nation and for the country that the Lord has given them and that they are back in their land. Hi, I'm on Mount Nebo, um, looking at the Promised Land where Moses uh, saw the Promised Land from, right from this mountain. Um, he didn't have the opportunity to go into the Promised Land. But... Welcome to Petra. This is one of the seven uh, wonders of the world. This is just one of the most beautiful places on earth that you can visit. If you come to Jordan, I'm going to take you to Petra. We're going to spend a full day here witnessing some of the most marvelous scenery in the world. So make sure you join us here in Petra.